A man is found dead in his study, sitting in his chair at his desk. There is a gun in his hand and a bullet hole in his head. The door to the study is locked from the inside, and there are no signs of forced entry. The detective arrives on the scene and immediately notices something strange. What is it? Answer. The smoke from the gun has not yet dissipated. This means that the murder must have happened just recently, but there is no one else in the study. A woman is found dead in her apartment, lying on the floor in her living room. There is a broken vase next to her body, and there are shards of glass everywhere. The detective arrives on the scene and immediately notices something strange. What is it? Answer. The woman's hands are clean. If she had broken the vase herself, there would be glass shards on her hands. A man walks into a bar and orders a drink. He takes a sip and immediately spits it out. This drink is terrible, he says to the bartender. What did you put in it? The bartender replies, just the usual vodka, gin, and tequila. The man shakes his head. There's something else in here, he says. I can taste it. The bartender shrugs. I don't know what you're talking about, he says. The man takes another sip of the drink and then falls over dead. The detective arrives on the scene and immediately notices something strange. What is it? Answer. The man's drink is full of ice. If he had been poisoned, the ice would have melted and diluted the poison. This means that the man must have been poisoned by something else. A man and a woman are found dead in a car, parked in a garage. The man is in the driver's seat and the woman is in the passenger seat. The engine is running and the windows are rolled up. There is a note on the dashboard that says, We're sorry, we can't take it anymore. The detective arrives on the scene and immediately notices something strange. What is it? Answer. The car is in park. If the man and woman were trying to commit suicide by carbon monoxide poisoning, they would have left the car in drive so that the engine would continue to run. A man is found dead in his bathtub with his wrist slit. The detective arrives on the scene and immediately notices something strange. What is it? Answer. The man's towels are dry. If the man had slit his own wrists, his towels would have been wet with blood. A man is found dead in a field with a shovel next to him. The detective arrives on the scene and immediately notices something strange. What is it? Answer. The shovel is clean. If the man had been digging his own grave, the shovel would be covered in dirt. A woman is found dead in her apartment with a smile on her face and a note on her chest that says, I'm sorry. The detective arrives on the scene and immediately notices something strange. What is it? Answer. The woman is smiling. If she had committed suicide, she would not be smiling. A man and a woman are found dead in a car, parked on a cliff overlooking the ocean. The car is in park, and the windows are rolled up. There is a note on the dashboard that says, We're going for a swim. The detective arrives on the scene, and immediately notices something strange. What is it? Answer. The car is facing the wrong way. If the man and woman were planning to go for a swim, they would have parked the car facing the ocean. A man is found dead in his office with a knife in his back. The detective arrives on the scene and immediately notices something strange. What is it? Answer. The man's chair is pushed in. If the man had been attacked, he would have tried to defend himself and his chair would have been knocked over. A woman is found dead in her house with a bottle of sleeping pills next to her bed. The detective arrives on the scene and immediately notices something strange. What is it? Answer. The woman's eyes are open. If she had taken sleeping pills, she would be asleep.